So in the last episode, you saw us take on St. Mirren in the league, and we won 1-0 before we took on Porto in the Europa League, and we drew 0-0. We wrapped it up with a cup final, baby, and we won 1-0 against Owen Coyles, Ross County, baby. So we are champions. Uh, this episode, we'll take on Rangers at home in the Premiership, and then Ludo Gretz in the champion, uh, champions in the Europa League, and then we'll wrap it up with another Edinburgh derby at Easter Road. Edinburgh, home of royalty, culture, and tradition. It's also home of two classic Scottish clubs, but there's only room for one of them. Welcome to the Pride of Edinburgh. So the first match of this video is a big one. It's uh, fourth place Rangers up against third place Hibs at Easter Road. Uh, our current form is pretty good compared to Rangers. A bit sloppy, so maybe, just maybe, we could take advantage of this and get one over the Rangers. So my start 11 uh, for this match looks like this. Glover in goal, Lazaroni, Hanlon, Erkstrand, Georgian, McGinn, Adam Silverker, Tillman, Quintongo and Fez up front. Got Murray on the bench, Bunny on the bench and Windass on the bench. So our visit is going with a 4-2-3-1. So let's give it our all. Rangers in their unfamiliar red away jerseys. Well, unfamiliar to me. Quick early shot for them. Goes wide. Corner though for Rangers. Trying to get themselves an early lead. And they do. Bruno Alves from the corner. Rangers got their nose in front already. Well, kind of blows a little bit. McGinn. Georgian. McGinn. Lazzaroni. Adam. Shot is bounced off somebody. And Hannon tries to clean it up. Now the corner for Rangers comes out to Candelas. It's blocked. A couple of ricochet. Bruno Alves chases this down, but it'll be a uh, free kick, I believe. Silverka gets a yellow. Candias with the free kick is cleared by Hanlon to Kuntongo, who tries to set up Adam, but uh, he hasn't got the legs for it. Bruno Alves with a throw. Brokes up, here comes Silverka. Erkstrand to Quintongo now. Tries to chase and finally get a, a, a decent chance for Hibs, perhaps. Adam, his shot is blocked, and here come Rangers counter-attacking. Herrera's shot from distance. Troubles nobody. Corner again. Adam to McGinn. Oh, wild shot goes what? up and over. Majoka now. Alves. Jack. Fahart. Dorans. Pina. Dorans. Candias. Pina. O'Halloran. Glover's shot is saved. Dear me. Dear me. Can't get my words out this morning. I'll look to change at, at half time. Maybe bring a second man up front. Murray's itching to get on. He's already been pestering me. He wants on. Fez just to slip it in there, but no joy. Erkstrom to hand and McGinn. Adam. Tillman. Been quiet. Silverka. Adam. Georgian. Quintongo shot is wide. It's best effort so far for Hibs. As we creep and crawl to the halfway mark, it's still Hibs 1. Sorry. Hibs 0. Rangers 1. I wish. I wish. So. Let's give it some. Second half gets underway at Easter Road. 1 0 down against Rangers. Brought on Murray. That's a decent cross there by Quintongo, but no one can really get on it. Brought on Murray for Silverka. Here come Rangers, though, looking for a second, which will probably be a big ask for Hibs to get back. And that was cleared off the line, and Lazzaroni does the final job and gets rid of it. Maybe around about 70. I'll make a couple more changes. Tillman, Fez. Can we get a lucky bounce? Lazzaroni. Hopefully can clean this up to Hanlon. Gives it away. Here come Rangers with Herrera. And that shot takes a ricochet. It'll be a corner. Pumped in Nick Georgian. Heads it clear. Here comes Rangers though with Wilson. Candias. But she goes back to Glover who clears it. And Tillman does the rest. Tries to set up Hibs on a counter. Fez's effort is just about stopped in process but Rangers trying to finish it off with candy ass and that's 2-0 it looks like it's job done for uh, Rangers Glover now boots this out from the back trying to get Trying to get themselves into this game, but it's been very, very tough. It's been slog as Rangers look to really wrap up 
the points completely with a third goal. And that is floated in there. But uh, it's not going to count. It's a penalty, though. Probably, probably will count. Travener. There you go. 3-0. Rangers are dominating this game. Hibs have yet even to get out of second gear. It's been very, very sluggish. I guess post-cup post, post -cup winning uh, hangover, I would say. The last 20-odd minutes. Adam tries to set Murray. His shot is uh, it's probably our best effort of the day. Glover boots it long. Dragomir to Adam. McGinn, Fez, Tillman. His shot is blocked. It will be a corner for Hibs. Can we make anything of it? Not really. Quintonga will go again. Dragomir comes in there with some power. But it's eventually blocked. Hibs now with a throw in. Fez loses it. Here come Rangers. Over the top for Pina. His shot is blocked and goes out for a corner. It's been a very, very woeful afternoon for Hibs. But would you have taken a win here or a cup final win? I'm sure you probably would have had a uh, cup final win as McGinn's effort is just floats over. Quintongo, McGinn, Erkstrand, Dragomir, Adam, Murray. A lot of bodies in the box. McGinn finally puts them back in the net. Um, so a little bit of fight left in Hibs, but I think it's too little too late. They need another goal. Around about now would be great. In fact, let's just throw it all at them. Let's throw it all at them. Throw it all at them, and if we can get another goal, which we won't by the looks of things here. Dragomir, Fez, Adam, Quintonga, McGinn, Murray, shot is over. Throwing it all at him. Throwing it all at him. We could get really exploited with this uh, nut casing tactic. If I have a two at the back. Only a couple bodies in midfield. Again. Punts it like this. Yeah, it's over. The match is over. Quitongo nearly makes it interesting. But uh, looks like Rangers have got this baby in the bag. Um, which is a shame. But hey. We'll get over this. Well, we need to get over it fast. Because we've got some big games coming up. Hibs 1, Rangers 3. That result actually puts Rangers into second spot. And Hibs now in fourth place. We do have a game in hand on Motherwell and Celtic. So it's not at the end of the road yet. Maybe we can still push up and onwards. Toward, I'm, I'm, what my goal is, I think, this year is... Well, I'd like to keep third at the worst but maybe just maybe it's next second but uh long way to go uh and hopefully uh, we can get our vengeance on rangers next time we meet okay in the second game of this video we take on ludo Goretz at their place in the europa league with the prospect well there's a couple of prospects that we could top the group believe it or not if hoffenheim do a number on porto uh but more than likely it's just the fact that, to, that we actually might qualify to get to the knockout round which will be massive for a team like Hibs. So my start 11 for this match is like this. Glover in goal, Lazaroni, Hanlon, Ambrose, Georgian, McGinn, McGall, Tillman, Quintongo, Murray and Fez up front. Our hosts going with a 5-3-2. So let's get this match on the way. Ludo Goretz kicked us off in their white jerseys. Hibs in the black. Georgian with a throw for Hibs. To McGall. Has a quick early shot. Just to let them know that we're here. Not here to make up the numbers. A draw. If the results stood as they do right now, we would go through. But I doubt they're going to end like this. Free kick by Ambrose is a decent effort. Again, early. Testing the... Uh... But here come Ludo Gretz. Mossolino. Wonderson. Midgesan's shot is wide. Glover. Boots a goal kick out towards Fez. McGinn cleans up. McGow, Tillman. McGinn. Blocked. Here comes Ludo Gretz. Broken up. But a mistake sets up Kusaru 
And they are now got their noses in front. So, hopefully, what's going on? I don't know what's going on in Porto. I need to have a quick look as McGinn tries to rectify the wrong there. But uh, there's no joy. Here come Ludo Gretz once again. Pumped it along. McGow picks it up. Gives it away, though. Here comes Mitchison. His long-range effort doesn't trouble the keeper whatsoever. That's our only Tillman loses it. Here comes Kisaru, the goal scorer. Sets up Nathandau. Broken up. Miguel to Fez. Finally, maybe Hibbs can get a bit of a break. Murray has a shot. It ricochets off the bar. Still just trying to get down to the Porto game here. McGinn, Murray, Lazzaroni, Tillman, McGinn, tries to get Murray, but it's blocked out. Ludo Gretz build again, it's broken up, Hanlon sets up Fez, he's got space, Murray's shot is wide. McGow, oh, that was, a t that was a teasing ball, but no joy. And currently, we're still in it. Because Porto and Hoffenheim are drawing. But uh, we need to get a goal. We need to get back in this. We need to get control of the game. Because we cannot rely on results elsewhere. So, Hibs get the second, match, second half underway. And uh, hopefully we can try and get ourselves back into this. I've made a sub. We've gone three at the back again. Two in the midfield. And, well, sort of five-man midfield. Or was it four-man? Four-man midfield. Three up front. It's a complicated formation, and hopefully if we can just keep ourselves in this game. We cannot really concede a second, especially so early on. Corner by Wanderson's, headed clear by uh, Ambrose. And there's a foul by Madden. It's not in a great position, but they nearly take advantage. Hopefully, uh, thankfully, Glover's onto it. Still hanging in there, and Tillman nearly nods us in there, but his header goes over. We are trying to keep our eyes out at Porto. It's still nil-nil. Cincinho, Kisaru, Moti, Darich. There's, there's a lot of quality names in here. Lazzaroni, now Ambrose, to Quintongo. Madden, the sub. Miguel, Fez, Quintongo, Madden's shot. Looks like it took a rebound, but, uh, but it's not. Stoyanov boots it long. Tillman collects, tries to set up Murray, but he's got a lot of work to do to get make this anything. It's eventually broken up, and there's a lucky rebound once again. Still, Hibbs can't tuck it away. But 60-odd minutes gone, we are still hanging in there by one point. A lot can change, though, here, and a lot can change in Porto. 75 minutes gone. We're hanging in. Despite all our efforts, Tillman floats it in there. Fez has a shot. And that is why nobody fancies scoring today. Absolutely nobody. Uh, nobody in Porto either. So that's a plus, bar, plus point. Fresh pair of legs for the last 10 minutes or so. Can we find a goal? Big save by Glover. Keeps Ludo Gretz at bay. Marcelina pumps it in there. It's headed clear. Ludo Gretz once again, big tackle by McGow, and he's brought down, but they carry on playing. Mijasan cross, blocked, Marcelino has a sh effort. It's just wide. Free kick, cleared, Quintongo now has got space to set up Madden, who picks out Murray, beautiful pass, ambitious effort by Murray. Really should have took his time. Still, it appears to be nil-nil with Porto and Hoffenheim. As we enter injury time, Marcelino, Alexandriov, Succino has broken up Madden, gets it back, I think it's too little too late, Ambrose over the top, Madden chases it down, uh, time is running out, ref has the whistle in his mouth, and it appears to be over, and Porto draw with Hoffenheim, so that my buddies, I believe, has got us through to the knockout stages. In the final game of this video, it's another Edinburgh derby where Hibs take on Hearts at Easter Road. Hearts currently in sixth, Hibs in fourth. We need a win 
try to put some pressure on uh, second place Rangers. So my starting level for this match looks like this. In a change of formation, Glover and Goal, Lazzaroni, Erkstrand, Ambrose, George and McGinn, Adam, Silverco, Swanson, Murray and Fez. In fact, I'm going to bring in the Dragomir for Swanson. And our visitor's going with a 5-3-2. So, let's get this baby underway. Hibbs get the match off to a start. Georgian loses it straight away. We've got some snow. It's snowing at Easter Road. Georgian, McGinn, Adam. Shot is wide. Playing very narrow today. Thought we'd mix it up a, a hair. Adam. Fez, long distance shot. Pat goes behind for a corner. And Charlie Adam will take it. Out to Fez. Dragomir. And then we have a goal. John McGinn opens up the scoring within eight minutes. That's the way we like to do it. That's the way we want it done. 25 minutes gone. We've still got our noses in front. Glover. Goal kick. Punts it wide. But picked up by Hearts. Silverka cleans up McGinn to Adam. Dragomir, Fez. Murray. McGinn, Adam. Silverka. Georgian. McGinn, Adam, Fez. Long build up here. Silverka is shot from distance, is wide. Lazzaroni, Fez. Lazzaroni, McGinn, Adam. Shot is wide. As we creep and crawl to the half time, we have our noses in front. And it's half time, baby. It's 1 0 up. So, Hearts get the second half underway. 45 minutes of football. We need to hang on for a victory. Adam, Silverka. Adam, shot from distance. See, so keep it stretched, but. Uh, didn't get a finger on it. Murray holds up play. Silverka. Dragomir. Lazzaroni out left. Crosses it in there. Silverka. Fez. Cheeky little effort. Just wide. Hearts now trying to build themselves. Boalbin. Salmon. Smith from distance. Cross it in there. Georgian has it clear. Balbin again. Salmon's effort is just wide. It's, it's one of those games that they're trying to outplay each other. Hibs have the dominance of possession, and that corner is just over Erkstrand's head, over the bar. McGinn, Georgian, Silverka, Dragomir, Silverka, Georgian, Silverka, Adam. The shot takes a couple of bounces, and Hibs come again. Georgian sips it across. We look for we look for a strike, but no one could get a really good effort on it. A lot of bodies in the place. Adam's long distance effort. Goes up and wide. So we're still in front, thanks to them. Again, goal eight minutes into the game. Um, but look at this. It's, it's you know, this formation might not be pretty. And the tactics used. Oh, Joel Dijon, his effort. Made Glover stretch, tips it over. And Isma levels it. Now we have to really give it give it some what for. Let's go attacking. We'll give him give a few minutes of that before we really rip it up. I was praising this formation. It dominates possession. Um, our chances have been uh, been a bit tight. Georgian floats in the Murray. Fez is in there. Is it in? Is it allowed? I'll take that. Fez needed a goal. Been on the... Uh, having a bit of a drought. So we've cr we cracked that up to attacking for just a few moments. And now we've pulled it back again. Adam with a free kick. It's blocked. He'll get a second bite at it. His second bite is also blocked. Last 14 minutes corner. Adam floats it in the Ambrose. Heads it over. Still not made any changes. I don't really want to tinker. Until it gets a little hairy. Smith. Dijon. Georgian, back to Glover, boots it, Adam, Fez, Lazzaroni, McGinn, Silverka, Dragomir, Murray's shot is just fingertipped over as Adam takes a corner to Fez, 
Back to Adam. I don't know what that was. It was a cross or a shot. Adam with a free kick. And he scores. Beautiful. Goal by Charlie Adam. One for the scrapbook. You, I'll take it. 3-1. That should be game over. We've got the cushion. And Hearts with a cheeky effort. Up and wide. Into injury time. Georgian. McGinn. Georgian. Some bodies in there. Adam has another strike at it. Tries to get his second. But no joy. Irkson with a massive tackle. Hearts with the throw. Smith. Floats it in there. Dijon. Smith. Cleared. Murray. He's brought down by Ballon. He just takes him out. Just has a go. Just says no, nobody. It's my goal. And there you have it. Hibs win 3-1 at Easter Road in the Edinburgh Derby. Massive. And that result does put us into second spot. Rangers do have a game in hand. But you know the most important thing is we're putting a bit of pressure on them. And hopefully we can see it out. Still got a long way to go in the season. We're about halfway, give or take. So before we leave you today, just show you the Europa League draw. So coming up for Hibs is a home away doubleheader against Marseille. I think it's, it's not the worst case scenario. Because look at the other uh, uh, prospects in Tottenham, Real Madrid, Dortmund, Manchester United. Some real heavyweights in there. But we've got a, a, a tough side. I'm not saying that we're going to walk all over them. But I think we'll give them a game. We might just, we could probably just squeeze past them. So that concludes this video. In the next video, we are, it's going to be a few games. We're going to jump ahead a bit. We're going to go to around about here. We're going to play Celtic at uh, Celtic Park, then Dundee, and then we're going to play Edinburgh City, baby, in the Scottish Cup fourth round. If you've enjoyed this video, you might want to check out my other two game saves, Glory on the Rhine featuring Schalke and Nulfia, and Reach for the Summit featuring Real Sociedad. Until next time, thumbs up, subscribe, ciao for now.